Hey up, murder bastards, I'm back. And uh, yeah, had a little joey round last night and we was a bit pissed trying to do Days Gone and trying to do the sawmill hoard. And uh, yeah, I felt really bad because I really couldn't do it. So just to prove to little joey that I can do it, uh, this is me actually just clearing it. Um, there is a bit of replayability in this game now, you can reset the hordes. It's 2023, I last did a video on this in I think 2020. Uh, still worth playing and it's still funny if the guys have got beers watching you play it or me and Ryan tonight are going to try and do this uh, on screen play just to amuse ourselves. Hope you enjoy me clearing sawmill, it will be fun. So first thing I'm going to do is uh, give myself an exfil, park the bike here, and uh, sawmills over there. So you're looking at between these two towers. If it's night time, they're all in the fucking pit ragging each other, uh, like they're having a soup kitchen orgy. Um, in the daytime now, they're going to be in the barn. So like, I'm just going to give you a quick run through of my plan. This is one of the ways I clear it. So we're going to bring them up here. We're going to probably. Uh, get up as high as we can and then if you turn around you'll have a choke point here so we can sort of around that area there we could probably take some out that's the plan anyway uh, you can go in there and get some materials uh, this and the Nero checkpoints has plenty of materials as you're going through uh, but we're going to try and maybe hook them around here take a few more out and then get on up high on this roof um, so we'll bobble over here uh, it's important to plan where you're going to bring them. Uh, it's like a big train set, this, and you can actually get them to choo choo and follow you. And in which case, you can use your pipe bombs. We're going to actually put down some traps now because uh, we are going to use these traps. So, might as well fucking lay some now. So, you can sort of set the area up with your devious little plan. Um, just to help you once the frantic shit starts because they are going to come fast and hard which is a little jolly lighter when people come fast and hard we're going to jump down here um, don't think I need any more of these bombs really but actually I might stick one up here there is a, a gateway we can they might try and cut us off at the pass there sometimes they come fucking charging through but we want to get them to this barrel uh, and then We'll try and explode this air. So we'll get that set ready. Remote. Oh, fucking hell, we're doing here. Yeah, daft cunt. Right, come on. Once it goes green, you can plant. And then we're going to bring them through this area. Uh, again, probably, if we're not too scared, turn back and kill a few of them. And then we're going to come through this door here. And you'll see a stack of pallets. Just uh, Malk's not robbed them. And then get up here. And then we're going to turn back and we should be able to then throw napalm down there. Um, probably see them all clambering up here like this. And we can probably turn back and shoot a few coming through the hole. Then we're going to run over the top. And sometimes we're going to go left. Sometimes we're going to go right off this barn. Just to see if we can actually... Uh, drag them down to the outer side of the map and then back to our bike for a, a restock of ammo um, that's the plan anyway so this is where we're going to sort of drag them round we're going to come up the side of here we can use that to sort of smash the heads in and slow them down a bit and craft this up so I'm fully loaded ready to go and uh, I'm gonna come back out of this barn they fucking heard me here we're gonna do a full lap now there is in between those barns a massive gas canister we can use and we're back now to the Twin Towers, which uh, controversially are still standing, so don't let people make you think 9-11 was a thing. The Twin Towers are clearly still there. Don't believe the hype. Right. Let's get this. And we want to get 
get napalms ready. Nick this bottle. And here we go. Up we go. And for those observant enough of you, I actually got killed pretty much immediately by falling off the fucking roof. Uh, so I just clicked in at the same point here, just doing it again. But all the stuff is set up is no longer there. So I was a little bit of a waste of time. Well, at least it gives you guys a fucking clue. Uh, so, anyway, let's do it twice. How hard can it be? So, here we go. Let's put the traps back on. So they were set up, but I guess I had to. Sometimes I put a remote bomb there, but I think I uh, wonder if uh, we've got time. Oh, no, that was the wrong one. Dickhead. So as you can see, my plan is going quite well. I'm just throwing the wrong fucking stuff up. Get off me! Motherfucker! Right. I'm oh, gonna hopefully not have fucking milliasm coming here now. Sometimes I'll come through this window here. Oh, yes. Keep on warm, it's a bit snowy out here. Snowy danger. Oh, you sneaky cunts. Right. Get out the guns. Oh, get off me. Trying to tear me clothes off. I'm so sexy. Uh, I mean... If you want to be a pussy hole, you literally now can just finish this horde from here. You can just stay in this tunnel and just keep tempting them back. Just opening a tin of tuna so they can smell it. If you haven't got a tin of tuna, just whip your dick out. The smell is sure to attract the zombies. It'll probably smell similar to tuna to them. A heightened sense of smell zombies. But, there's half the horde left, so we're going to have a bit more fun. Take that off me. Dilga. So I'm not going to finish the horde from here. I want to just um, 
I want to take him for another little spin up on the roof just to make it oh, just to make it uh, more entertaining. Probably just do some dugger dugger damage here. She was fucking going on. Curse prick. He's just gonna oh, just fucking knife the gun. Oh. See? All I've done there is just stuck my dick out of my zip. And you can smell it. Fucking coming for it. But I don't want to do this pussy like any shots. Let's get into the deep fucking dirty fucking mess of zombie blood. Make you up. Uh, Fifty five bitch. Polaris, motherfucker, I'm gonna take your head off. Yeah. Oh. I think I'd go a long way around. Oh! Twat, then try to suck a punch me from behind. Fucking hell. I'll tell you what, boys. When you've got someone watching you do this, couple of beers in hand. It's going to be entertaining. 8th of July. On the big screen. After poker. Get your mash up on. Me and Ryan are going to entertain you doing this. IRL. In real life, bitch. Uh, this. That's dangerous, that bit. Sometimes if there's more zombies, they're going to come from both sides here and you won't know where to go. It'll be one big fucking bukkake pie with them all just fucking coming from everywhere. You can get off me. Uh, right. Still got quite... Fucking hell, I thought I'd killed quite a few. There's still nearly a quarter of the cunts left. This is a lovely little vantage point, this. I think what we'll do, we'll bring them up on the roof here, and then we'll just twat the fucking head in. Because I actually haven't got much ammo left without going all the way back to my fucking bike. What are you doing, dickhead? What are you doing, dickhead? Oh, look at this twat. This is the gas. Right, let's blow this up. It's usually better if there's a load of them. We'll see if we can... Uh, Lure some of these pricks into here, see if we can get a bit of a bang for the buck. There we go, come on, come on, yeah, come on, come this way, you prick. You can fuck off. Oh, what's this not? Boom. Ah, I don't know how many I got there, but it wasn't fucking many looking at that gauge. Right. I think you'll agree, Joey, when I've not had a fucking five gins and 16 beers it's a little bit easier but you did make it look easy joey for your first attempt as well you little phenom right come on i want you to run a train on me not in that way i want you to fucking chase me up here come on get up here 
can't get up here so I can knock your fucking teeth out if you go in here, you zombie cunt. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Ooh. I thought I didn't have my plimsolls on. That would have gone right through me. I got a use for you. Should have settled down a bit now, so the plan is get these remaining twats. Let's get a let's get a fucking big napalm crafted for one of those growlers. Piss jugs, these are big piss jugs, and uh, we'll, we'll get them up here now. Hey, piss jug them for it. Get rid of a few. Uh, rinse and repeat this now. It should be. My final stand. Yeah, if you just fire them right there, you can get quite a bit of action. Oh, no. I'm fucking dying after doing all this. I did want just a nice clear run. Hey, there's that sucker punch con I thought I'd killed him. See the gauge go down. Right, let's get them through this fucking barn now. We're gonna finish these on the roof, like I said. Fucking done. I'm gonna go. No bullets, because I don't think I'm looking out of any by the time we get there. Sometimes these bullets in these. Yeah, bitch. Rick James, bitch. Oh, I think I might have made a mistake here. Oh, fucking hell, no, no, not now. Oh, no, fucking hell, this is lucky if I got all this. Oh, oh, fucking hell, thank God, I only have to do another run there. Oh, no, this, oh, no. My health is, this is heavy shit. What's going to happen here? Right. Oh, let's have a look what we've got. Right, I need to heal. Give me some, get myself bandaged up. Fucking hell, that was close. That, that was nearly game over then, boys. With like fucking... Oh, I was going to say three zombies, but there's still quite a handful. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this ain't looking good. Fuck, you know. Still quite a few of the cunts. Right. Oh, I fucking hope Steely's enjoying this. I really do. Let's do them on the roof now. This has got to be it. Come on. Yep. Well, we've got fuck all bullets left, just like I've said. Fuck all. Just... Why do I keep getting my gun out? Come on. I don't know if I'm going to do this, actually, because there's quite a few more than I thought. And I've got... Half a health life. Ah, it's done. It's done. Fuck you. And fuck you. 
so that's a sawmill boys so yeah days gone in 2023 is still pretty worth playing i uh, hope you enjoyed it if you did like the video remember to like and subscribe and uh yeah on the 8th we'll probably do a little bit of this in real life and uh, as usual i'll see you in the next one